so Since your hair, I'm asking you to stay I'm trying to fight my tears I just got used to it Say hey vlog. hey vlog I can't read it You don't like those chips? I can read it I can read These it These are sun chips What is sun chips? Um, they're healthy, good chips I love hot chips uh, chips. I, love, I love those. Anyways, y'all, I know I look terrible. I know I look crazy. But I'm about to head to urgent care because my chest has been hurt for days. And I've been trying to let it just go away on its own. You know, just thug it out. But it ain't working like I can't sneeze. I can't cough when I get hiccups. I cry like it's bad. I can't take a deep breath in like I don't know the last I don't even remember the last time I took a deep breath. That's how bad it hurts and it's probably like my lungs are inflamed like the last time I went to the doctor. Which is common in this time of the year. In this weather. I wanna go see Black Panther, but I don't think I feel good enough to do that. But I really wanna see it like everybody's been talking about Black Panther and I haven't even seen it. And if you haven't seen the first one, give me your black card right now because no way. I've been seeing too many people saying they haven't even seen the first one. Are you black? But yeah, y'all, we're about to head to the urgent care. I really don't know what I have planned today. It's just been time for me to pick up the camera. I haven't picked up the camera in a little minute for real. So yeah, I'm going to see you guys when we get there, most likely. Let's hope I don't have no fluid in my lungs. My hands are so ashy. This is sad. I don't know if y'all can see. Oh my gosh. I don't care. We're not worried about looks right now. We worry about health, okay? Health comes before anything else. Isn't my stink so handsome? Look at the fit, y'all. Watch out. Look at the fit. You're so cute. Where you getting that from? Okay guys, we're at the doctor. I'm gonna go to movies. You wanna go to the movies? Mm -hmm. You have to be a good boy. You're not gonna be a good boy? Okay, y'all, so we finally out. It's 3.39 now. It's going to be 4 o'clock. So we've been in there for a little minute. Um, she gave me, they did an EKG to make sure everything was good. And they gave me a Toradol for the pain and inflammation. So I had to get a shot in my buttock. And she said that should make it feel better. If it gets worse, then I need to go to the ER. And the thing about having sickle cell is like, they don't want to really treat you for anything if it's not sickle cell. You get what I'm saying? Like, not even that. Not even, not even that. I didn't say that right. You can go in and say you have leg pain. But once they see that you have sickle cell, they're going to be like, I think you should go to the ER. This could be a sickle cell crisis. And you tell them, like, no, this is not a sickle cell crisis. This doesn't feel like sickle cell. And it's like... They can't do much because they feel like they let sickle cell stop them from really treating us when it don't be having nothing to do with sickle cell at all. Like it's just really annoying. But um, yeah. So I guess we finna get something to eat. Kingston said he wants pizza, so we might get pizza. I'm finna look up mellow mushroom because I don't heard about that, but I've never ate it myself. What is have y'all had mellow mushroom before? Like what is it? Like is it is it a pizza buffet? Like how CC's and um Stevie B's is? Ooh, they got they got some wings. Is it a pizza buffet? I really wanna like I'm interested. I got a pizza. You wanna go here? Yeah. It's in Stockbridge. Let me I need to look at some photos because I'm really like I don't understand. What is it? It's a pizza. Okay baby. I don't even know if I feel like going to Stockbridge, even though it's right down the street. Let me call Java. I'm pretty sure she knows. Sure. Hey, have you been to um, Mellow Mushroom before? Yes. Is that like a pizza buffet? What is it? Well, no. It's not no. I don't remember no buffet in there like CC's. It's just a big restaurant. They sell pizza, but not a buffet. It's a lot on their menu and a whole bunch of different pieces, but 
chose from though. Oh, okay. See, so, yeah, I was just confused about that. But Keisha said he wants some pizza, so I guess that's where we're going. Yeah, that pizza good. Just depend on what pizza you get, really. Have you had that pepperoni? That's all I eat. Yes, yeah, it's so good. That's all I wanted. I had to make sure. Did you did you ever get to go to the um, barber? No. Okay. And he said I had to book him through the app. Well, that's what I seen him on his caption. Yeah, so I didn't feel like doing all that day. Kingston, what time is it? Pizza time. Say pizza time. Pizza time. <laughs> been up this early in so long and I'm so happy and we just gonna manifest that this is the beginning of me really waking up early every single day except weekends like I I'm so excited that I'm up early like I didn't have to force myself out of the bed or nothing today like maybe my prayers are working baby and I went to sleep really late so the fact that I have all this energy right now it's shocking like nobody can't tell me that ain't god because me i will sleep in if i'm tired i'm tired and it's like he lifted all of that procrastination and tiredness and laziness out of my body this morning and i just want to say thank you jesus but um anyways the bad news is i don't feel good anymore like they gave me that butt injection and i was feeling good no pain woke up all the pain is back so i might have to listen to what the doctor said and just go to the er but we're gonna do that at the hour my errands and do what i need to do today okay yeah because i don't know if i told y'all but kids to start school on the 28th that's the goal but i have something to do on the 28th so I might end up starting like december 1st or something like that yeah but i'm trying to get all his forms together for that so that's really all i have to do honestly and if i do decide to take my hard head self to the er I probably should you never know she like she said it could have been my sickle cell but i just feel like i've been having sickle cell crisis for 20 years now why something new want to kick in like i never have no sickle cell crisis in my chest for real like not in my torso area so that's new and i feel like that's probably why i feel like it's not sickle cell maybe it is sickle cell yeah i thought i was doing good like i was trying to wing off getting blood transfusions because they say once you get blood transfusions you can't stop getting blood transfusions and it just makes me so mad because none of my siblings have to do this. I don't know if y'all know, but I have hella siblings on my dad's side. All of them, well, most of them have sickle cell like me. Then you have some who have sickle cell trait, depending on their mother. The ones that do have sickle cell, they don't even get sick. And I'm like, what am I doing wrong? Like, that's that shit I be talking about. Like, God really thought I was his toughest soldier. And it's fine. It's fine. But like, damn, give me a break. Okay, let me stop being so loud because Kingston is asleep. He just crawled into my bed. He always crawls in my bed around this time every day. That means he's not in a deep, deep sleep like he was. Or maybe he is. Y'all know boys fall asleep like so easily. What's up with them? They can be wide awake one minute, next minute, knocked out. I know y'all probably like, what are you doing? I'm about to make this green juice the girls been drinking. I actually got it in my notes and I feel like I have all the ingredients. I have every ingredient except coconut water. Whew, it hurts y'all, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna just use regular water. Hopefully that doesn't make a big difference. Let me, let me light my candle first to get the vibes going. Isn't she pretty? Make sure y'all go watch my clean and decorate with me for Christmas. It's not much, but it's definitely like getting you in the Christmas spirit and it's a beginning. It's a beginner. 
or whatever you want to say to my Christmas decor. I love Christmas. This is my favorite time of the year. Not only because it's Christmas, but because this is the time when a bad bitch was brought into the world. And like, everybody should be celebrating that. So, okay. So, the recipe. Spinach, green apples. I don't have green apples at the moment, but I have some peeled apple slices, like a big bag of them that I haven't even eaten. Hopefully they're not old. Um, avocados, hopefully those are not old because Target been having me messed up. Like why I wanna do a pickup order? They wanna give you the worst avocados out the bunch. Like I took them out the bag and they already mushy. Be for real. You can hook your girl up. Suha shots, I don't have, it don't have to exactly be Suha shots. I don't even know if I'm saying it right. Suja, I don't know. Like, basically these like immunity shots. So, we got, I got happy, immunity, energy. So today, I don't know, I'ma just pick one. Y'all, this has ashwagandha in it. I've been seeing a lot about this on TikTok and supposedly it's supposed to like, just make your whole world stress free. You don't give a fuck about nothing all that so we're gonna get some of that today because yeah okay let me get my apples my apples don't look old don't they look good okay yeah i thought i had spinach what if i don't i don't think that's spinach i think that's regular lettuce are you serious? That's a green leaf lettuce. What kind of green juice am I about to make with this? Hold on, let me look up something. I know it's something I can replace it with. Okay, it says the best thing to, re to replace spinach in a smoothie is kale, romaine lettuce. I cannot imagine drinking romaine lettuce. Ew. We might have to try this another day. I really thought I had spinach. Beet greens, carrot tops, celery. I can see myself putting some celery. What do you think I got there? No. I just can't see myself in like that lettuce in here. What kind of lettuce is this? Yeah, I don't think, I was really excited. I don't think we're doing this today because I want my first time to like actually be the right recipe, you know? So we'll try this another day. Sorry to get your hopes up. I probably should make like some avocado toast or something before this goes bad. Anyways, cheers. We're gonna take our shot today. This one is blood orange guava. Um, I'm really scared, but probiotics are very important. So I'm scared of these. I don't know why. You know what's wrong with me? You know what's wrong with this generation? They be scared of shit like this, but they be quick to take a shot of Hennessy or something. They be quick to take a shot of peach Ciroc. So let me be a G. I gotta be doing that Hennessy or something. Okay. This one actually smells good. I think I actually like guava. I don't eat it much, but this smells really good. I just know it's probably nasty. Do I need to shake it? Did I already shake it? I'm talking a lot this morning. Okay. This is actually not nasty. Got a little stronger aftertaste. Do something to your mouth. But it's really good. I can't take that in one whole shot like some people do. I don't know why I just can't, but. I have to really take my time with stuff like this because I be quick to throw up. Like, it's so easy to make me throw up. Last little bit. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers to new routines and a productive new year cheers my kitchen looks a mess real bad i would show y'all but not even that bad it's just like too cluttered but i'm about to play some christmas music um i'm about to make breakfast 
I'm going to eat avocado toast. And I'll probably make Kingston like some eggs, grits, sausage. I'm trying to be a little bit more healthy. I got to I gotta drink my water before anything, though. I want a life for Christmas. just one thing. I don't care about the family in the Christmas tree. I just want you all. so excited because I used to be in chorus and every time the holidays come around we would sing this and it's just like it's a part of me you dig <laughs> turn this down I never told y'all that I got admitted but yeah as you can see it's the next day um, I got breakfast I don't feel bad I never did feel completely bad but I just can't be walking around with my chest hurting 24 7 so I just wanted to go ahead and get that out the way I really hate to be here but y'all know they say health comes first and it does it does i hate coming to the hospital but yeah i'm gonna listen to y'all because <laughs> i can't be walking around with my chest hurt. like it really wasn't nothing to me but you never know what it is for real so of course they think it's sickle cell it don't feel like sickle cell but So I'm about to eat and yeah, hopefully I'm not here for too long because I got stuff to do um, and I just hate hospitals. Simple as that. Y'all, Sky brought me a milkshake from this new restaurant called Chicken Cone. So we finna try it. They brought me a fruit tray for dinner because that's all I really had. A fruit tray? This on the side? Yeah, because I, uh, everything else is making me nauseous after the medicine. Oh, well, I love the big straw. They need no steak. Lots of that in I'm trying to call the Sam. Oh, this is the call Sam. I mean, this ain't the baby flow. Labor and the loose. What kind of shower is this? I don't know. Okay, let's see what the hype is about because she been in this every day and I'm gonna let y'all know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love the cup, like, is it, did they double it or something? Maybe I double it, yeah. Oh, I thought this it, one was leaking, so I, I thought it was a steak. Okay. What's that, is it No, 
it's what, good. What you rate it? I like that it's not so thick because I hate really thick milkshakes that Cook make out. your throat dry. Like, huh? Cook out and milkshake. I never had one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I rate this like let me take another one. Mm -hmm. Let me take another one. I write this um seven. What? What? This is a ten out of ten. It's not nasty. It's just I'm not a milkshake girl. You'll never catch me buying a milkshake. Well, this is the best milkshake. But it is good, and I don't even like milkshakes for real. And I walk with the water. You text me I walk again. Mhm. I was little. It got waffles in it, y'all. What else they got food wise? Chicken and salad for family. Chicken Hot chicken? Like buffalo chicken? chicken? This is the end type of chicken. This is our waffle. Mm. But they really good at the waffle. What's this? Oh. Fish. Mm-hmm. When y'all, I be itching, just pat it a little bit like it. Y'all got the same bed as us. Y'all got the same setup. Mm -hmm. Let me show y'all my bestie. She is a nurse. Yeah. No, a nurse in the making though. I'm speaking into existence though. They know about the color, you ain't no nurse. Okay. Yes, she's a nurse in the making. We're gonna be nurses together. She gonna beat me. But I'm gonna do catch up, you know, and we're gonna work at the same hospital wherever we decide to go, child. So, y'all better come and see us. Come see me, especially if you got sickle cell. In about how many years? Like 30. Come see me in like three years. Because I'm starting my classes in January. You gotta, do I really wanna go to that school I was going to? Yeah, you can do it, celebrate. You can do eight weeks. Or go to GMC online and do all your courses and get them done at Yeah, I might do that. Mm -hmm. It's easier. That's what How much they call? GMC. How much they call? GMC. Um, I don't know. My husband's paying that $4. But it was like, my mom's last thing that financial aid is my last thing that so, yeah, I need to do financial aid. When do I do that? I need to start mm -hmm. doing it now. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta apply. But you gotta have taxis. I got taxis. What do? Put up my head to have some. Mhm. Yeah, you gotta do all that. So just a little update. I'm starting to look worse and worse. I looked a little cute earlier. I don't know what's going on, but. I thought I was gonna get a blood transfusion today so I can be up and out of here. But apparently my levels went up. It was a, my hemoglobin levels, it was a 6.9 or something like that, 6.6. .6. And now it's a 7.1 and the doctor keeps saying that he wants to wait. So I'm just really not trying to be here long, y'all. Like, all I know is I better not miss Thanksgiving. I need to be out at least three days before Thanksgiving. Honestly, well before that, but you know, it's just really annoying. Like, I know what I need, just give it to me. And like, I tell them all the time, I never have crises unless I need a blood transfusion. That's the only time I have a crisis. Like, yeah, you have things that kind of trigger it, but for me, I don't be needing, I don't never have a crisis unless it's time for a blood transfusion and honestly I, I really got away with the blood transfusion this time because y'all know like before I turned 18 I was getting them once a month so my body don't really got used to blood transfusions now my body feels like it cannot function without a blood transfusion and that's what I hate about it and at the time the doctor told my mom that I would only be doing the blood transfusions for a couple years, but 
we talked to another doctor and he was like once you start it's really hard to stop like i don't see you being able to stop getting blood transfusions so that's what i be trying to do i really be trying to wing off of them and find alternatives but so far no luck with that so yeah i don't went way over a month without a blood transfusion and i done did good but i can tell when it's that time because like even y'all tell me my eyes be yellow they don't look too yellow right now but honestly i believe it's just the camera they actually don't look that yellow what the fuck but um yeah i look so bad um i'm just ready to go home i'm ready to be my baby and i'm in the holiday spirit this year like i don't have time for this i'm trying to be ice skating i'm trying to do all this holiday stuff with my friends my family we got it we we trying to plan photo shoots i don't know if i'm doing vlogmas a lot of y'all have been asking me that um i mean i could try i'm not gonna promise nothing but we'll see i if i do do vlogmas i'll probably i'm not even gonna say that i'm probably still get like a cute christmas intro and all that stuff, but I don't think it'll necessarily be like an everyday thing. But of course, I'ma still title my videos, Vlogmas this, Vlogmas that type of thing, you know? So, yeah, but don't be expecting videos out of me every day because my life is just too complicated and I, I've accepted that. My life is way too complicated for me to be trying to upload a video every day. It's just not possible, so, <laughs> yeah. Um, I'll see you guys later. It's currently 10, 12 p.m. I'm watching McKinney right now. I'm about to snack on those hot buns. Um, and yeah, I was trying to order me a pink iPad because that's what I want to get myself for Christmas. I want to get myself an iPad and I want to get myself some beats. Of course, it would be great if somebody else could buy it for me. It'll be more of like, you know, a surprise. It'll feel better, but nobody ever buys me shit, and that's okay. But I want—I was trying to buy myself the pink iPad and the Beats, but apparently, like, this phone, y'all know, I don't know if I told y'all, I got a new iPhone 14, and it's not connected to my AT&T account I have already. So they're trying to make, like, they're trying to run my credit and all that stuff. And it's like I already have a... AT&T wireless account. Y'all don't need to do this. I just want my iPad. So, yeah, I'm going to call them in the morning so I can order my iPad. Um, They say iPads make your life way more organized, so we'll see. Um, But, yeah, I just really want that. It's so cute. A pink iPad. We've been asking for a pink iPhone for the longest, though. When that comes true, yeah. Um, But, yeah, enough rambling. I haven't talked to y'all in a little minute. So, yeah, I'm just bored, honestly. See you guys tomorrow. The days, the days just keep going and going, and I just keep getting uglier and uglier while I'm in here. I don't have my face washed, don't have nothing. Like, my skin is turning into a dry-ass shell. And I'm pretty sure you can see that. But, um, yeah, what have I done today? Nothing. Um, I'm sorry this is going off. It's time for a new IV bag. But, I mean, I planned a Christmas photo shoot. So, I haven't been sitting here doing anything. I planned a photo shoot. Still planning it. But I went ahead and booked it with my friends. Um, we're doing... Now we're just trying to find fits. And I'm trying to see who's going to do my makeup. And how I'm going to wear my hair. Well, I might just do a cute little updo or something like that. So, not really worried about the hairstyle. I can always do that last minute. Even though I probably shouldn't, but y'all know how I am. Um, and yeah, I'm supposed to be getting a blood transfusion tonight. I was supposed to be getting, getting it. I don't know what happened. They're taking a long time. Um, but yeah, I basically told them I wasn't leaving until I got it because... Y'all gonna be looking stupid when I come right back. And y'all see that. 
y'all see that that's what my body is asking for like i'm telling y'all this is what my body is asking for this is the only time i get sick so they listen to me this time they saw i was serious like usually i let everything slide i'm done letting shit slide i looked her straight in her fucking face and i said that's cool i don't care about y'all trying to take the medicine away from me to be funny i don't care about none of that I'm not here for your medicine. I'm here just to feel better. I don't give a fuck about your medicine, okay? I just want my blood transfusion. I don't even really want it, but I know I won't truly get better until my body gets it. So, it will get louder. Shut up. Oh, it needs plugging up. But yeah, I forgot what I was saying. Anyways, hopefully I go home tomorrow. Um, my battery also went dead on my car. Um, I let my mom drive it while I was in here. So yeah, the battery went dead. And I don't know if she left it running or left it on, whatever. But it's dead now. So, yeah, I got to find somebody to jump my car off so I don't be stuck down here. <sighs> if I can't find a way to jump it off, um, I'm going to just tow it to, like, the Chevrolet dealership. And I'm going to just let them service it, do the whole thing. Probably put a new battery in there. And, Yeah. I hate that I look like this, like, what the fuck is this? I look so ugly, like, you ever look ugly, but deep down, you still feel like you look like a bad bitch? Like, that's me, like, I, when I say I'm ugly, I don't really mean I'm ugly. I just mean I look like a bomb, but I'm never really ugly. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. I just wanted to show y'all. Well, let me keep my arm straight. Anytime I bend this arm, it beeps. This is a terrible spot. Like, I hate getting my IVs right here, but sometimes with sickle cell, it's hard finding a vein. So, sometimes you just gotta, you know, work with what you got. So, yeah, I'm getting my blood now. I've been getting it for a little while now. He said it should be done in like two hours. You know when you when they doing blood, it has to go like really slow. So yeah, if y'all didn't know, I am O. Am I O positive or O negative? I'm one of those. Y'all know they say O is like the rich blood. So <laughs> just want to put that out there. But um, yeah. I'm getting my blood and I'm so excited because that means I can finally go home. And my eyes are white again. Yeah, my eyes are white again. I've always had these little like spots in my eye. I don't know what to call those. But other than that, they're turning back white and I'm so excited. I hate when my eyes are yellow. They be having me feeling so ugly. So, yeah. I'll see you guys tomorrow. I gotta find somebody to jump my car off. And I gotta go get a new battery tomorrow because I don't wanna have to keep dealing with this. So, yeah, I think I'm gonna call my sister and let her husband do it for me. I didn't tell you, I have a sister that got married. Yeah, I'm not married yet, but yeah, my sister, I told y'all, y'all know, if y'all been here for a long time, Y'all know I have four, well, three other sisters the same age as me. It's four of us all together. And one just got married, and she has a baby named King. I'm so excited for her. So happy for her. I would show y'all them one day, but y'all know how some people just hate being on camera, don't want to be seen on the internet. That's my sister. So y'all probably never see her. But, yeah, she looks just like me. 
a lot of my family thinks she looks just like me. Um, yeah, y'all can find that vlog and see what my siblings look like, though. Just in case y'all were curious. It wasn't a vlog. It was a Q&A. Um, yeah. I'm just rambling. I'm so bored. I miss you guys. I feel like we haven't really been bonding lately. And my face is starting to peel. Yeah, it's time for me to go home. But I love you guys. And I'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> Look who's picking me up from the hospital. I'm so sad I can draw myself back. But my battery's dead, so. Is my camera in the car? Oh, no, I forgot it. I told you to remind me. I did. I'm coming up before I was leaving. I told you that. I'm sorry to get home. Just some skincare. Take a nice shower. Just cater to myself. Okay. It's Thanksgiving Day. I'm sorry to eat some dressing. But on a serious note, y'all, why do I look like. What is this? This is not my style at all. This is not me. But I don't have nothing to wear. This is why it's important to get like, what's the word? Clothes free family events. Because none of my clothes give family events. <laughs> it gives club, it gives, you know, hot girl. Yeah, I'm struggling right now. But do y'all like my hair? I saw it on Pinterest, so I copied it. I haven't done, I haven't styled my hair in a little, in a little while, so. Cute. Okay, yeah, I feel like this is more me. You know, let me let me show y'all. I'm sorry, my counter looks crazy right now because I'm in a rush. Like the Thanksgiving thing starts at three. My mom's in there yelling at Kingston because he don't want to put his clothes on. Hold on. Okay, I had to take that phone because he can't do nothing without the phone distracting him. So y'all think the little side curls are too much. Honestly, I don't care what y'all think. Y'all know I'm extra. Okay. I feel like the silver and gold is really tacky, but I don't have no gold ring. So, it's going to give today. And I'm going to throw on my Ugg boots. I wish this had a little belt with it. Like, wouldn't that be so cute? And this top is a little dirty, but thank God for this jacket. Because... <laughs> then I'm going to throw on my Billie Eilish perfume because... Okay, well you need to put your um your pants up. Okay. Yeah, you Pull them all the way up, Kingston. You gotta and tell mom to put on your black boots. I'm gonna put on my Billy Eilish. I feel like it just gives a really cozy vibe. I'm gonna just lotion my ashy hands. Should I do makeup? It's honestly too late to, to be trying to do makeup. And I in my natural face right now. I could do a little coverage, but I I don't know. I feel like my natural face gives more when I'm wearing my natural hair. Like, I feel like it brings out my face. Like, I don't care for makeup when I'm wearing my natural hair. Something about natural hair and makeup to me, for me, it don't go together. Not on me. Like, I don't know. I just, I don't care for makeup when I wear my natural hair. But when I'm wearing weave, it's a must. I do need some mascara. Because I don't have no lashes. I really was trying to be like the baddest bitch in an event today. But I don't have none. Then that's fine. I'm going to just use some at my club on time. Because most of that mascara over there is mine anyway. I'm just really trying to be on time. Like, I hate being late to stuff. And I'm already like an hour away from making, so. Look at, look at my baby. You're so handsome. You need to go put on your black boots, like I said. Why does this curl look better than the other one? I'm going to clean when we come back because we don't have time. I don't even know where my phone is, y'all. Mom what? put socks in there. She put socks in there. Yeah. We're doing Say happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving! Yeah! yeah. <laughs> Why are you happy me? Cause I'm not going to you. Tell them what you eating today. I don't know. I'm going to tell you what we eating. We eating macaroni and cheese. I'm eating turkey bro! 
Well, guess what else? Who? Dressing. Dressing? What does it mean? Well, guess what else? What? Turkey. Get up off that floor. He's not in the kitchen. He's not in the kitchen. I have a jar my name in there. You gonna eat a turkey? No. Why? Because I love turkeys. You I, love turkeys? Yeah, I love chicken and turkeys. So you're not gonna eat it? No, chickens. Oh, you eat chickens? Yeah. That's mean. You eat baby chickens? Yeah. Look at my baby, he's so handsome. I'm with Ashanti, y'all. Tell them happy Thanksgiving. I, that's so corny. Tell them, that's happy not Thanksgiving. corny. Pick on my plate, y'all. I'm gonna look good. Collard greens, macaroni and cheese, squash, dressing, yams, um, potato salad. Here's Ashanti. Potato salad. Well, she basically got the same thing, but she got a real. You got ham or turkey? Ham. Is that good? Mom, I'm gonna get the one at the top. <laughs> Y'all got two different potato salads. Here's Kingston's place. God has been so good. <laughs> it's blessing me over and over. Let me go dance. Doing great Stop. things for me and my family. How are you guys? Just great for me for another year. Amen. 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 All right, she get to go a little longer because she she the oldest. <laughs> All right, after Daisy, we're going to our next decision when Maddie's not here. So we know she the oldest, Wait. 89. But uh, so the next one would be Mania, and you know, she would always be here for the Thanksgiving. And this was, I miss on Thanksgiving Day because she, she would always do the turkey and I would do the turkey. And she would call. And she would say, hey, girl, get up and put that turkey in the oven. <laughs> I said, you was in the oven? She said, no, I'm in the bed, but I can tell you what to do. <laughs> so I missed that. She was just tall to aggravate you. So we just thank God for the memories of all my siblings. So now we Why are you trying to go to children. Cynthia, you the oldest. So we just start with Cynthia. They say a few words what you think. Oh, okay. Of course, she just told you, Mamie and Robert is my mother and father. I'm the oldest of six siblings, and I am just so grateful that I'm alive. I turned 66 years old, and I did contract COVID, and I survived. You want to introduce your your siblings? All right. Well, I have two children: <laughs> TJ and Tamika. Uh, Timothy and Tamika. Uh, <laughs> since Blair said we ain't going nickname, nobody gonna tell you. So nobody don't know who Timothy is. Uh, TJ is my oldest, and then Tamika. Tamika is here with her husband Sam and their two kids, uh, Emery and Avery. Y'all let them see them. That's what it is. <laughs> You're done. <laughs> Take a drink. Take a drink. <laughs> I just thank God we're here. Thank everybody here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Robert Glenn Jr., whoever don't know me. <laughs> Got my son here, Robert III. Hey. We call him Trey. Little baby, look at your wife. Happy Thanksgiving, y'all. You know, I got a daughter. I got a sister. Tony! And let's thank God for life, health, and strength. And thank God all of us still like our daughter. Thank God for family. Yeah, and all of us are still healthy and healthy. Hey, damn it, didn't get us until we just thank the same God. Hey, Oh, get it, get it. I got a new wife. Oh, yeah. I got a new wife. Well, 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 I got
grandkids. I got my grandkids. Tanaya, stand up. My baby girl. I'd like to wish all of you a happy Thanksgiving. Um, my sister already introduced everybody pretty much. Sin is the oldest. And then Mom Junior next. And then Jan. And then me. And then Greg. And Lisa's not here. I need here. to go it and up. And my husband is somewhere in here, William. And I my up. grandson, Justin, is here. And I have three children, and they're not here Sherrod, Justin, and uh, Quintisha. And it's a blessing to be here. I'm just so thankful to be alive and well. And we love you guys. And it's just so good to see all of you. May God continue to bless our family. Amen. 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 Y'all look busted right now, but I want to say thank you so, so much for clicking on this video. Thank you even more if you made it all the way to the end and watched all the way through. I really appreciate you guys who do that. And um, I just want to say I hope everybody had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Um, I'm very lucky and blessed that I was home on Thanksgiving this year because I thought I wasn't going to be. But I am. Well, but I was. And I had a good time with my family. Um, and yeah, I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next vlog, video, whatever. Comment down some video suggestions because I kind of feel like I'm getting too comfortable. And I want to start doing new things or bringing back old things that I did went, once did. Sorry, y'all know I can't talk on camera. But um, yeah, I love you guys. And like I said, I'll see y'all in the next one. If you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe and yeah.